Hi, today we are talking about two-way binding. Two-way binding is the concept of sharing and giving. What you give is what you can expect from others. Why two-way binding? Two-way binding gives components in your application a way to share data. Use two-way binding to listen for events and update values simultaneously between parent and child components. Angular's two-way binding syntax is a combination of square brackets and parentheses. This syntax combines the brackets of the property binding with the parentheses of event binding. I'll create a sizer component. In our component, I will define a size value property and a size change event. The size property is an input, so data can flow into the sizer component. The size change event is an output, which allows data to flow out of the sizer component to the parent component. Next, there are two methods, dec to decrease the font size and inc to increase the font size. These two methods use resize to change the value of the size property within min max value constraints. and to emit an event that conveys the new size value. In the sizer component template, I'll create two buttons that each bind the click event to the ink and deck methods. When the user clicks one of the buttons, the sizer component calls the corresponding method. Both methods, ink and deck, call the resize method with a plus one or minus one, which in turn raises the size change event with the new size value. And below them, I'll add a label which displays size property and dynamically updates its own font size. In our root app component, I'll include an app sizer component and I will use two way binding to bind font size px property to the sizer component. And below that, I'll add a div which will utilize this property to adjust its text size. In the app component, font size px establishes the initial sizer component size value by setting the value to 16. Clicking the button updates the app component font size px. The revised font size px value updates the style binding, which makes the display text bigger or smaller. The two-way binding syntax is shorthand for a combination of property binding and event binding. The sizer component binding has separate property binding and event binding is as follows. The event variable contains the data of the sizer component size change event. Angular assigns the event value to app component font size px when the user clicks the buttons. To use two-way binding with form elements, we need ng model, which I will cover in the form section. And that's all I had for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Please let me know in the comments if you have any suggestions for future videos or if you like this one. Also, don't forget to subscribe on this channel. There's more videos on Angular and also on React are coming soon. Stay tuned and I see you in the next video.